not mind waiting on the Lord God. You, the, you gotta wait on the Lord God. Sometimes we just gotta tear it. I, I know we don't want to hear that, but you know what? I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. Some things you just got to wait for. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you get the call, but that don't mean that you're gonna move. Come on, yeah. Come on, here. Come on. My Lord, you got to grow a little bit. You gotta grow up a little bit. You grow up till you can grow out. But no, the moment you get it, I'm I, I, I'm saying that because I've been right there before myself. God give me a word, I'm expecting it next week. Next, not next weekend. Next week, God gave me a God gave me a word. What's that? God gave me a word. Tell me my God gave me a word. Give me a word. Next week. Don't happen next week. I don't know what's going on. That's us. That, 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 that's us right there. Oh, it don't show up that week. I don't know what's going on. I'm out the back. That's us right there. But if we don't, it don't happen then. Oh, Lord, I'm about to. The like Lord must be calling me to consecrate. Three little things. No three little ones. Just one. That's us. That's we gonna move God. Stop it. We moving God. That was like, go eat. It's true. True. God does send us on a fast, but I, when, when, if you will be truthful, I, I know I've done it before. I didn't see God hand move, so I didn't, I, the Lord didn't say fast. You know, you know when God takes the fast. When God takes the fast, it seems like it's a breeze. You go through it, you're next all day gone. You're like, oh yeah, no. That's when the Lord gives. But whenever you go do it to move God, oh, that's, oh what's wrong? I'm tired. Oh, no. I'm tired. You think I'm tired. What's wrong with you? I'm passing. I got you messed up right now. You told 20 people you had on the bed. But you expect me not to do that. That's us. Is that not right? That's us. We want God to move. So then, then, you know, but see, we're so, we're so churchy. I don't even know what to do. We're so churchy. We're so churchy. You know what? We don't get the answer in a week. I am going to fast. Bring it through, bring it through. <laughs> and we do it. Yep. And we do it all when we struggle. Oh my God. <laughs> Struggling ain't the word. Oh, yeah. We upset with everybody. Don't call oh. me, don't talk to me. I got a headache. My body hurt. Everything. What's wrong? I'm fasting. Oh my God. And that's not how you're supposed to do that. <laughs> but we're trying, I'm saying that because we're expecting something that we don't want to wait for. But whenever it comes, whenever God is in it, yeah. sometimes we'll have you to wait for it. Yeah. I'm trying to encourage somebody because oh. if it didn't happen today, yeah. are you still going to expect God to do it? Yes. If it doesn't happen today, do, will you, this, for some of us, it might just be a test. If it didn't happen today, will you still expect God? I'm trying to free somebody up because if it didn't happen, you can go eat, child. Because <laughs> it's not going to push his hand. Oh my God. I'm trying to free you up because somebody to somebody there, listen, somebody today, Lord, at 424, 24, 4 o'clock. Expect. 
I'm closing, but I want you to know if you're hoping for something and you can see it, it's not hope. Because that means you already got it. I, you, you, you should broaden your horizons because I have said that this is the second service I've said something is on the horizon. You may think, yeah. and you're like a pastor, 424, that you can believe what you want, but I know in December of 20, uh, December of 19, uh -huh. God gave the word something on the horizon. That's right. in, in month of March, That's right. March 26, 2020, we had the shutdown. That's right. That's right. Oh. God gave the word, those of you who were in all yes. sin. In December of 19, God said there's something, and he kept saying something on the horizon, something on the horizon. We had no idea about nothing. We went to work. People were just having a good time. By the time January hit, it was across the land. They weren't there. We were still going to the games. Is that not right? I don't know. I was still going. I was still going to the games. By the time March showed up, May just no no sports on television. Everybody was like, "What? Can't go to the grocery store." Yeah, but oh, we're like, oh, we were struggling. I'm saying that to give you to let you know. Whenever God gives that type of word, He said that was in 19. He gave that word something on the horizon. I, I don't make these things up. I have not something on the horizon. I'm saying that because if you're believing God. For something I don't know what your hope is for. Yeah. I don't know what you're believing God for. I don't know, but I guarantee you, God just said hope will not disappoint. Yeah. If you're expecting Him to do it, I sit around and just you know what? God's not afraid of your conversation. I don't know. I, I don't know how you pray, but I pray seriously. Yeah. Lord, you yeah. said. Yeah. I mess I'll be rocking and everything, Lord. I'm expecting you to do I'm expecting that soul to come in. I'm expecting that I'm expecting you to send the prodigals. I'm expecting I don't put I'm expecting God you to do work. I'm expecting Lord God, I, I got a pain. I'm expecting you to heal. I'm expecting that thing no. I, I don't know what anybody does, but I'm expecting. If something is close to me coming from me, I'm expecting. And Lord God said, and do you realize the Lord God he loves that type of prayer? He loves whatever you are expecting. He's passive. He's giving you a word. But don't try to rush God's hand. He said sometimes you just go have to wait on it. Because the longer the wait, the better it is. Yes. I believe that. I believe that. I believe that. Because the longer the wait, the better it is. I believe that. I believe that. My Lord, the longer the wait. Some of us, in the, the wait, you're like, oh, I've been waiting. The Lord God said, but it's going to be better when we wait for it. Thank you, Lord. It'll be better when we wait for it. I told you, I, I really, I'm closing, but I don't like, I don't like all fast things at all. <laughs> I don't. I really don't. You're like, wait a minute. I don't. I, I'm not a big fan. I'll eat it, but I don't like it. I'm pretty to this. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I'm closing, but if you give me something fast, I'll take it if I have to. But if you're going to do something, do something that's going to last. Yes, oh my God. Mm. Do something that's going to last. Don't give me grit. You know. yeah. Put that thing in the pot with some boiling water with salt and butter. And let it bubble and pop up and put a top on it and all of that. Then you bring that to me. Don't give me that. Oh, by the time five seconds, water. I like thickness. I'm saying that because I uh, see uh, that's a great example. The same thing with the anointing. That's all. Same thing with the promise. Whenever you wait for, you want something that's going to be temporary that when God gives it, you you have it, but it won't last. I don't know about you, but I don't want no relationship that's just going to be temporary. I don't. You're like, oh, I'm gonna get into. Oh yeah, I, I, it's good for right now. What? 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 Five years from now. Wait a minute. It may be good right now. I want, look, that, that, that's it for me. Yeah, that's <laughs> I want that to be so the same thing with the anointing. Yes. You don't want something that God promised you. You don't want to get it quick. And when you get it quick, when problems come up, it's no longer there. Wow. But the Lord God is saying, but if you, you tarry me, and, and it, I'm expecting you, Lord God. I, I'm, I'm believing you. I got my hope in you, Lord God. I'm trusting and believing. I was confident in you. But look, I say, if you just stay in there with me, keep expecting me to do it. Keep expecting me to show up and show up. Keep expecting that.
that vehicle to come in. Yeah, keep yeah, expecting yeah, that yeah. house. Keep right. expecting that spouse. Oh, keep expecting. Oh, keep expecting. Keep oh, expecting. Oh, oh, we gotta yeah. keep expecting that. Keep expecting that God when He promised you would come to pass. You're like Lord God. I know. I know that you called me, and He said I did. Are you expecting me to show up in that life? Are you expecting me? Because the moment you just well, you know, whatever. And the Lord God said, I mean, there's no urgency. But if you start expecting and saying, Lord God, I'm expecting. I'm expecting my house. What? I'm expecting my own land. I'm expecting to be operating in ministry. Yes, Lord. I, I, under the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. I'm expecting to do what you have for me to do. If I'm to touch young people, then I'm expected to. If I'm to go out, and if I'm expected to, to minister to men or to women and whatever, what if I'm I'm expecting that. The Lord God said, don't, don't put that on back burner. Put that right there and keep the fire hot. You're expecting God to heal you? Lord God, I'm, I'm expecting. I, I, I have faith to believe. Now I, I'm expecting it to happen. The pain is about to leave right now. There it is right there. The name of Jesus. That same pain, that, that throbbing that you were feeling, the Lord God said, if you have hope and expected God to, to heal you right there, he's about to do it. As I'm about to close, the Lord God is saying that people of God, we've got to have hope in God. You've got to have hope in God. That's just how powerful. It's a fundamental thing, but it is so powerful that you've got to have the hope in God, not in anybody else. As I close, I want you, those of you in, in Psalms 42, just remember, you don't have to turn there, but it says it two times. It says it in Psalms 42 and 5, and also Psalms 42 and 11. It, it's like a heavenly echo is what it's called. Whenever you, God says, whenever you hear a text resounded again, Identical, the Lord God says, it's like a heavenly echo. Why are you cast down on my soul and why are you disquieted within me? Hope in God, for I shall yet praise him for his health and his countenance. The Lord God has said he spoke that David was able to cry that out twice. Then that's like a heavenly echo to let you know hope in God. That no matter what you do, put your hope in him. Continuously trust him and put your confidence in him. And he said, for I shall yet praise him. No matter what, I put my hope in God. So that's why your praises have to continuously stay going up. Yeah. You're like, why should I praise God? I don't feel like praising. Because you're expecting God to do something. If I told you to praise God for a million dollars, you'd practically lose your mind. Come on now. I tell you, I'd be Come on. You wouldn't have to. Come on. <laughs> We're not for asking me at all. You know, what's wrong with pastor? This is a million dollars. <laughs> you know, what's wrong with them? She said, you, they got to do them shooting everything. You know, what? Praise the Lord. That would be not, nothing. Stop saying that because the scripture says, hope and yet praise him. That means whatever you're expecting, God, praise him anyway. Praise him while you're waiting. Do you realize some of you haven't even got the message right there? I'm going to close right there. I pray that you reread this later on. And the Lord God, hope in God for, for yet I shall yet praise him. That means almost like you expect him, so go ahead and praise him. You expect him. That's why I'm saying. That's Maybe exactly. I'm yet pra I'm a praise him before I see it. In the name of Jesus. Lord. I'm a praise him before I get it. I'm yes, a praise him before I get the keys. Yes. I'm a praise him before I get the house. I'm yes. a praise him before you get the spouse. Praise God for the spouse. Before the child comes home, praise him like the child already home. In the name of before Jesus. Before everything, praise him before the money gets in the bank. In the name praise of Jesus. Praise him before everything else. Praise him before the money gets in the bank. Praise him before the money gets in the bank. Thank you for my age. Yes. Hey! Oh, I want to thank you that I passed. Yes. Some of you, you got to school. Kids in school, it's almost it's like the end of the year. Yes. And you're like, Lord God, I don't know. You should be praying. Lord God, let me pray. Matter of yes. fact, let me give you an A praise. Yep. Yes. Come on here. Come on here. Like, wait a minute. I didn't say a B praise. I said nope. an A praise. Yes. 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 Lord. Yes. Yes. Lord. Yes. That's Lord. That's Lord. That's Lord. Lord. That's Lord. That's Lord. That's Lord. That's Lord. That's Lord. Not just that. The letter A, B, C, no. Nope. A free. You give him an A free. I'm not going to just, I don't want to be free. I'm going to give him an A free. Yes, I give him enough praise to say, Lord God, I'm going to pass this yes, step. I want somebody to give him A praise for a, for a promotion. Yes, 
Jesus. Lord, individual 